Hi, I'm Paul Schmidt. I teach U.S. History and IB History of the Americas, and I have goats. Uh, the story behind the goats uh, is that we have a son who is very much afraid of dogs and a son who is very allergic to dogs. And so we got the goats uh, because they were kind of the, the closest thing we could get to dogs. Uh, for those of you who may remember Miss D'Angelo, the old biology teacher, uh, she has a small farm with lots of animals and we visited the farm and my son fell in love with the goats. So we got goats. They live for about 10 to 15 years, so we hope they just hang out with us and give us some nice pet companionship. In order to house his three goats, Luis, Cisco, and Hugo, Mr. Schmidt and his family built a shed for them and a pen. We had nothing. Uh, this was just a big yard. When we come home, they like to hang out and get petted and play with us. They like to run with the kids. And then at night, when it starts to get dark, they know it's time to go and close themselves up in the shed for the, for the safety of the night. You know, all we do is feed them and clean them and keep the shed clean. Other than that, they're really pretty, pretty low maintenance. They do like their treats, though, which is why they're swarming me. <laughs> Go over there, guys. You know, when you have kids with special circumstances and they want goats, that happiness of the kids and the goats are more important than the perfect garden or the perfect image of, uh, of your house. So, yeah, that's... The toughest part is losing our garden. Other than that, it's, it's all been really, really fun.